Maligong bagong taon. I look forward to 2021, which I'm sure will be a better year. Continue to work closely as a community and innovate in everything that we do as we move forward. Happy New Year and goodbye 2020. I hope I never see you again. I wish you all peace, health, and prosperity in 2021. Happy New Year to everyone. Happy Year of the Ox. May the New Year bring humane wisdom, renewed compassion, and resilience to us all. Good luck and I hope to see you soon. To a better normal for 2021. All the best for 2021. Cheers to better journeys in 2021. New Year's wishes for 2021. Actually, I have three wishes for everyone. Uh, first and foremost, of course, as we enter 2021, it's been a bad and difficult year for, for many. I, I hope that there is a way uh, to get people continuously healthy, uh, be it through testing or vaccination, uh, that the whole of the Philippines have an opportunity to get inoculated against what's been a, a really very difficult uh, and uh, disease to manage. So that would be my first wish. Uh, my second wish is that uh, the COVID-19 has prevented a lot of people from traveling, coming back to their country and seeing their families. Um, my second wish is that uh, I hope uh, with the inoculation and with testing that people have a chance to come back, uh, visit uh, the Philippines, visit their families, those who live abroad and have a chance to reconnect. And thirdly, um, it's also been a difficult uh, year for the economy. I, my third wish is that people can go back to work safely, um, start earning a living again and get our economy going again. Uh, and with that, uh, I look forward to 2021, which I'm sure will be a better year. Thank you. Hello and Happy New Year to everyone. I hope you are all well and safe. Two or three years ago, when we would talk about disruptions, we thought of it in terms of technology and moving fast enough to keep up with it. I don't think any one of us expected a global pandemic like this to change our lives. Even the feng shui experts never saw this coming. I salute all our frontliners, especially our frontliners at Robinson's Retail. I am immensely grateful for the dedication you have shown as together we tirelessly kept our stores running at the height of the lockdowns. Realistically speaking, the challenges will not end in 2020. There will still be tough times in 2021 and beyond, but I am genuinely optimistic that we can weather whatever future has in store for us. Happy New Year to everyone. Happy Year of the Ox. My year. That makes me 48 years old. Keep safe. When thinking about tomorrow, constant optimism should prevail regardless of the past, regardless of the present. This pandemic has placed us in a state of uncertainty, leaving us with negative vibes. But let us take a few steps backward and assess the situation we're in. Has it not also brought about courage and strength, goodness and compassion in many? There is always more than one way to look at the situation. More important is how we react to it. May the new year bring humane wisdom, renewed compassion, and resilience to us all. As 2020 comes to a close, we mark the end of what has been a historic and tremendously challenging year for all of us. We remember with great sadness the suffering that we had to endure, including the loss of lives and livelihood. Nevertheless, 2020 is distinct in the many stories of selfless service, generosity, kindness, and heroism of our countrymen. I don't recall any other time in recent history when we were so united as a community and so ready and willing to help each other. We deeply appreciate the sacrifice of our everyday heroes during this difficult time. We also honor the dedication and incredible courage of all our frontliners during 2020's most critical moments. Moving into 2021, it is my hope that we enter this new year with renewed optimism and an even stronger spirit of community. With the rapid development of COVID-19 vaccines, we now have the hope to give greater peace of mind to as many of our countrymen as possible. However, this will require time and much stamina from everyone. Without downplaying the tragedies of 2020, 
we have seen unprecedented advances in research, technology, and cooperation models. I have no doubt that we will build on these successes, continue to work closely as a community, and innovate in everything that we do as we move forward. I enter the new year with much hope that we can get through this adversity and emerge stronger as Filipinos and as a nation. As the new year approaches, let us give a moment of thought to the challenges, failures, and achievements of this year so that we can more accurately navigate our journey to a better normal for 2021. Now that the vaccines are available, we can see the light at the end of the tunnel, but we do not know how long the tunnel is. I think 2021 will be the year of recovery, and I hope that by 2022, we will see significant economic growth for the Philippine economy. As the new year dawns, I hope it is filled with the promises of a brighter tomorrow. Stepping into a 2021 is not just about changing dates, but about how we change ourselves and society for the better. In the spirit of uncertainty, we bring in the new year, trusting in these constants. Hope, courage, solidarity, and strong connections with our stakeholders. In short, our Bayanian spirit. These are the same values that have taken New Day through the highs and lows of our 20-year journey in the Philippine market. And so my wish for next year is to remain even more connected with you so that we can witness not just a change of dates, but real positive change for ourselves, our industry, and our nation. From my screen to yours, health, happiness, and a fresh chance to make things better. Let us create our own better normal together. Cheers to better journeys in 2021. As kumbatiin kayo lahat ng isang uh, manigong bagong taon, sana ay maging maganda yung papasok ng taon para sa ating lahat, sa ating pamilya, sa ating sarili, at sa ating bayan. Naniniwala ako na pagamat nahirapan tayo nito 2020, ang 2021 ay magiging mas paayos. At uh, basta sama-sama tayo at kaya natin yan. Naniniwala akong higit na magiging malakas ang ating basa dito sa karanasan natin sa 2020. Yung mga, yung mga inabot natin hirap dito 2020. Sa tingin ko lalo tayong inihanda para sa isang magandang kinabukasan sa 2021. So muli para sa ating lahat, sa inyo lahat, manigong bagong taon. I wish each and every one of you at the Manila Bulletin the happiest of days for the year ahead. The past year has truly been a very challenging year and undoubtedly we all yearn for the coming new year to be much easier and kinder to all of us. As we grapple with this pandemic, let us not be hindered in seizing opportunities that come our way by forging ahead with agility, resilience, and courage, and ensuring that we are able to achieve the goals and objectives we have set out to do in the new year. I fervently wish that the much-needed life-saving vaccine will soon be widely available and readily accessible to all our fellow Filipinos so that we can achieve herd immunity and be safe from COVID. Indeed, the valuable life lessons we all learned from this pandemic serve as a reminder to all of us that we are all interconnected and interlinked and that we are only as strong as our weakest link. Now more than ever, we all need to pull together and support one another in whatever way we can so we can all bounce back stronger as soon as possible and continue to help build a better society where no one is left behind. On behalf of everyone from the Gokongwe Group, I wish you all peace, health, and prosperity in 2021. Happy New Year sa inyong lahat. My wish is that this new year brings us closer to some sense of normalcy and that we appreciate the things that we miss, even the things that we may have taken for granted in the past. Uh, I also wish that the world continues to heal and to recover. I know this has been very difficult for all of us, even heartbreaking for some. I hope 
that we all find the strength, the courage, and even the inspiration to get through this major crisis in our lives. And that along the way, we find some small forms of success and blessings and that we are able to share this to all, to all those around us. I continue to pray for you and your family that you remain healthy and safe. Happy New Year and goodbye 2020. I hope I never see you again. My New Year's wish for 2021 is I hope we're back to the old normal. Pwede na mag-inuman, pwede na mag-travel, uh, pwede na mag -watch. And sometimes I wish, okay na rin heavy traffic, kung lang yung walang traffic. Uh, so, siguro may nangyari na yung Skyway, nangyari na rin bang, ano. So, good luck and I hope to see you soon. Maraming salamat sa inyo lahat. Happy New Year to all our Manila Bulletin readers and our Ever Milena fans. I hope we've seen the worst of 2020 with all this COVID and pandemic disaster. It was indeed unprecedented. I'd love to see our families go back to normalcy, wherein we can travel together, church, malls, and also traveling abroad without all this protocol. Just like the good old days. Above all, i love to see everyone without their face mask on. i love to see all the beautiful girls with their favorite makeup from their eyes down to their lips with their favorite lipsticks. All the best for 2021.